Hi, this is an example memory presentation for the memory chapter. Your presentation doesn't have to be exactly like it. It just has to follow the general guidelines. You could have more slides. You technically can't have less because there's no way to have less. This was taken from a student's project that I had to modify in order to make it right. Uh, make sure you read through the instructions on the presentation itself and make sure you reference the rubric because uh, in all the presentations I looked at, um, very few people looked like they had looked at the actual rubric to make sure they had the specifics for the motherboard and the specifics for the memory in question in order to get full credit uh, for each one of the rubric items. So make sure you go through that. So this is going to be an example of one that I took from another student and fixed. So let's go ahead and get started. Hi, my name is Jimmy John. I'm from Kingston Memory today, and I'm here to present um, two memory things from Kingston Memory that you requested. A little background on Kingston. Um, we are located in Fountain Valley, California. This is our headquarters. We're south of Anaheim, California. Uh, we've been in the memory business for a long time. Um, and we are one of the largest manufacturers of both memory and memory related devices like solid state drives, which you'll see the solid state drives that we have to offer as well coming up in future presentations. Um, but that's a little bit about Kingston. What you asked us for, uh, you asked us for the fastest eight gig of RAM for the Gigabyte uh, B550 AC motherboard. That is a low class, we'll call it a home motherboard. Uh, because of that, we opted to give only non-overclock uh, for stability of that particular system. You'll also ask us for 32 gig of memory for the Gigabyte B650 Aorus. That is a gamer class high-end motherboard. So for that reason, we are going with faster memory uh, than just simply non-overclocked for that one. And we've chosen our uh, memory appropriate for those two motherboards. So a little bit about the first motherboard. The first motherboard, here's a little look at it. It takes DDR4 RAM from 4733 all the way down to 2133. It does have four memory slots, so it takes up to four 32 gig sticks, but you asked us for eight gig total for this motherboard. And again, we decided to stick with non-overclocked memory. So we're looking at the 3200 speed memory. This motherboard does take dual channel. It supports ECC and non-EC, ECC RAM. However, the ECC RAM is uh, specified on here that it's for specific CPUs. So for that reason, we also uh, decided to give you non-ECC RAM since it would be the most versatile for the motherboard in question that you've given us to give you memory for. So the memory that we've got for you today is the Kingston Fury Beast DDR4 sticks of RAM. Uh, because of the fact that you only wanted eight gig, we're selling you one single stick of eight gig RAM. Um, that's so that in the future, if you decided to upgrade to 16 gig, you could just buy one more stick and put it in there. It's $40.15 right now. Uh, total capacity again is eight gig. It's 208 pin DDR4 RAM. Again, it's 3200 speed. Cast latency is 16. You can see the timing on there, 16, 18, it'd be 16, 16, 18, 18. Uh, it's non-ECC. It does have a heat sink on the, um, on the Fury Beast memory. It is capable of doing high performance games. It is a good stick. It's got um, color with this one, you can uh, program it for RGB color. And with all Kingston RAM, it's got a lifetime warranty. Now, if we needed to look at the actual price, this is a link to the price on Newegg. However, you said that Newegg, oh, opened right up, great. So there's the price on Newegg. Also, the specifications are down here, but on Newegg, um, they did not list our memory warranty. So I also provided a link on here directly to the Kingston site where we talk about the Fury Beast DDR4. And if we were to pick that speed, that stick, single module, and we go down to the specifications section on that, you'll see that all Kingston memory has a lifetime warranty. So as long as you own this, if something goes wrong with our memory, um, it will be replaced by us. And you can also see we sell it as singles, kits of two and kits of four, 
for that memory. So that is your first option that you ask for, for that first motherboard, $40.15 for that single stick of RAM. And I did a screen capture of the actual Newegg site just in case Newegg didn't open today for you since that was a problem. Second motherboard is the Gigabyte B650 Aorus motherboard. This is a picture of the motherboard right here. It's got four memory slots. The memory specifications for this motherboard is DDR5. It goes all the way from 6600 overclocked down to 4400 non-overclocked. It again takes 32 gig sticks maximum capacity. It can take 128 gig of RAM. Uh, it does dual channel. It has two basically dual channel slots there. It's non-ECC RAM and unbuffered RAM. So we brought you today the Kingston um, Fury Beast again, but this is the DDR5 Fury Beast. Um, this is 32 gig just like you asked. We're bringing you two 16 gig sticks so that take advantage of that dual channel capacity to make it as fast as possible. This is DDR5-6000. Cast latency of 36, which by the way is the lowest cast latency we offer on our DDR5 module. Timing 36, 38, 38, 74, non-ECC, unbuffered RAM. These have heat spreaders on them, but these are not the RGB model, so they don't have any uh, color on this one, and that's why it's only $134.99 for 32 gig of RAM. Um, and lastly, we've got our lifetime warranty on there. If we need to look at the price on there as well, we can follow that link uh, to Newegg showing where they have it. But again, Newegg does not list our warranty. It has the basic specifications, so I also added a link to the Fury Beast 5 RAM on our website, which you can go to the specifications there and look at all the specifications for our RAM. And again, all of our RAM has a lifetime warranty. As long as you own it, we will replace it with the same or like memory if it's not in production anymore. That's one of the advantages of buying from Kingston. So those are the two sticks of RAM that you guys asked for, for the two motherboards that you guys gave us to specify for. I again took a, a screenshot of that one just in case Newegg did not open um, for the presentation itself or in case they didn't have it for sale or wasn't available anymore. You can see, see that it is still $134.99 for that two stick package there. If you have any questions, I'll answer those now. If not, here's my... Um, uh, work cited and my resources that I used for uh, this particular presentation and uh, I added the Kingston sites later so that's why it's not on there those have the uh, one at Newegg but it should also have the Kingston on this on this presentation as well so that is an example of hit all the rubric items didn't require a lot of slides I didn't have to have those uh, screenshots, but they're always a good idea just in case um, Newegg doesn't open or it's not available to show that when you did the research and when you made the presentation, they were there. This didn't take me more than 30 minutes to modify the existing student's presentation and select the correct sticks of RAM. So hopefully that helps you with your presentation. What you're looking for, all you need is those rubric items on the motherboard, i.e. what RAM does it take? And what are the specifications for the motherboard to make sure that when you give us that memory, it follows into those specifications and it does work. Again, the home or low-class motherboard, 8 gig total. The business or mid-range motherboard, 16 gig total. The gamer or high-end motherboard should be 32 gig total. It says right there in the, pre in the um, assignment, there are no other options to that. That's what you're supposed to be selling us so we get that wide range. And that is the memory presentation.